So here's how you find 0 0.875 inches on a ruler. Really what we need to do is convert this to a fraction. The easiest way to do that is consider this 0 0.875 over 1, then we multiply the top and the bottom, the numerator and the denominator. Each one of those we multiply by 1,000. Because what that'll do is that'll get rid of this decimal point. So 1,000 times 0 0.875, that equals 875. 1,000 over 1, that equals 1,000. So now we have a fraction. We don't have any decimal points in it. But now we need to simplify this a little further. 5 goes into both of these numbers, but I'll bet 25 goes into both the numbers as well. So let's divide 875 by 25. And that gives me 35. And 1,000 divided by 25, that is 40. So we're close. We can simplify this a little bit more, though, because 5 goes into 35. 7 times 5 is 35 and then 8 times 5 is 40. And there we have 7 eighths. So when we're trying to find 0 0.875 inches on our ruler or our tape measure here. It's right here. It's 7 eighths because these are equivalent. They have the same value. What that means is it's right halfway between 3 quarters of an inch and 1 inch. That's our 7 eighths of an inch. That's probably the best way to do it. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.